Hello everybody and welcome to Clara's Tech Hub. Today I'm going to talk about the basics of Microsoft Excel. This is a tutorial on Microsoft Excel basics and I'll talk about how to use a flash view. A flash view can be used for quick data entry. This is a very good tool in organizations. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and you'll see more and more videos. Let's say you have a list of names, but I want to split the list into names and surnames. I can do this using a flash view. So I'll write the first name of the first person and drag all along to the last name. Now the first name has been copied by default all the way downwards. So I will right click here on auto view option and select flash view. See what happens. All the first names have been copied all at once. Now for the surnames, I will write the first one. Let me write the second one. Look here. It tries to read a pattern. All the surnames are now appearing. So I'll just click enter and all the surnames will be instantly copied. Now I want to write their emails using flash view in the same way that I did for the first names. So I'll write the first email address. Uh, I'll put here the email address of the first person and everyone's email addresses will be copied downwards. So a flash view is used to, it is used close to your original data and it's not dynamic. If I were to try and copy the email or the surname in a column which is not very close to the original data, you will see that uh, it will not be able to copy the pattern, it will not be able to see the logic. So you only use a flash view uh, when you are close to the original data. Okay, so now let's move on to another example. I have the same list of names, but some of the names and surnames have small cases at the beginning. If you look closely, uh, the beginning of the names and some of the surnames have got small cases. So I want the names to be rewritten uh, in the next column with the correct cases. Uh, the, the first letter of the name and the first letter of the surname should be in uppercase. So let me write the first name here correctly. Then I will highlight the whole area. Then I go to Home tab, go to Editing Group and select Fill. From the options displayed, I will select Flash Fill. See what happens. All the names will be displayed here with their correct cases. Ta -da! Okay, so let's move on to another example. Uh, I have the same list of names and I want to write the initials only. So I'll write the initials of the first person, then the second one. See, it has recognized the pattern. And all I'll have to do is to press enter and check for people with second names. It has displayed three letters for the initials. Ta da! Well, I hope you like this video and don't forget to like, like, like. For more videos, you can subscribe to this channel. 
Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.